Welcome back to the channel everybody. Obviously, this video is about moving house in Thailand. I've managed to get out of the tiny condo. It was a little bit expensive. Get away from the rip-off landlady and move and it went down in a few hours. Fantastic moving company. And uh, I'll be uh, also going to the Hohen night market. Happens every night. Very interesting. I hope you enjoy the video. Thanks very much for coming back to the channel and please enjoy. Okay, so this is the new place. This is the uh, front area. I'll have uh, the landlord's actually going out to buy me uh, an outdoor setting to sit here and relax, but this is where I'll keep the bike and wash the bike and everything here. Got a hose and everything. Okay, there's a water pump in there to make better pressure. This is a really big area and it's all covered in. It's actually got a ceiling and down lights. But it's, uh, let me have a look, I'll step it out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, around seven meters. Got a power point even out here. Yeah, so inside, I'll probably change the lighting at some stage. Yeah, so the lounge room, main lounge room, which is like the front room. Really nice lounge. They've just put new cushions on the lounge because uh, the other ones were too soft and worn. So that's nice. Aircon, yeah, it looks like uh, an exhaust fan up there. Yeah. Uh, that TV will go upstairs because I'll be putting my TV down here somewhere but I've got to work out how to fit it because it's a lot bigger than that. So really big storage area in there under the uh, stairs. The downstairs bathroom. Really quite nice. Quite pleasant. Water. I've got my own shower head to put in anyway. So. And then you've got the dining room, which is huge. But I'll probably make this my office or my studio where I do all my uh, video editing and stuff like that. A nice bench. And a couple of breakfast bar stools there. Good fridge. Uh, electric cooktop, very handy. I've got a little plug in one as well. Hot water for washing, sink, yeah, wrap for all your for stuff. Brand new washing machine. Brand new washing machine. Fantastic. Fantastic. Thai people love covering stuff up with plastic. A lot of them even have their remote controls covered in plastic. Okay, let's go back up and have a look upstairs. This hallway is as wide as it looks. So, yeah. Let's make sure the light's off in the kitchen. Oh, it is, it's, it's got a, um, it's got a, uh, a sunlight thing. I find it really strange. Oh, there's this hallway light down here. Okay, so that switches for the dining room. And here, the bottom half of the stairs. Stairs are really beautiful. Really pretty, varnished. Estepol, I think, something, something like Estepol, but pretty, yeah, quite nice. I mean, it's a fairly old place, but it's uh, been renovated really well. Looks like they've uh, sanded and estepol all the, um, all the uh, parquetry floors. He's put a floating floor in this bedroom. Quite warm in here, but it's got air con and I won't be spending much time in this room. This will be the spare room for visitors or friends. 
uh, can get plenty of light in here, but not much of a view. Because the street next door, those houses back onto these ones. Yeah. Okay, so this hallway's fairly big too. And um, this is the uh, bathroom. I've got some nice LED lights, bulbs to put in here. Bathroom's uh, been kept really clean. It's really big. Shower recess is as big as it looks. It's uh, like a metre wide and probably a metre and a metre, well, 1200, 1200 or more long. Yeah, so it's a big shower recess. Yeah. Okay, so that's the shower in the top bathroom. Almost an ensuite, it's right next to my room. And this will be my room. I absolutely love these parquetry floors. Just incredible. Well, similar to a parquetry floor. TV stand or whatever if I want to put the other TV up here I probably will put it up in here somewhere and hook it up to my uh, Wi-Fi booster aircon and of course the veranda out there this lock so you can always have the front door open and have the breeze coming through yeah lighting I've got to look for power points in this room for Charging things are probably down behind the bed there somewhere. Plenty of wardrobe space. Plenty of wardrobe space. Plenty of storage space everywhere. No more bags and boxes hanging around the place. Everything will be stacked away in uh, in storage areas. Look at this. Look at the hanging space in here. I don't know what you hang on here. I don't know what that's for. I'll find it some reason, some use for it. But yeah. Good quality cupboards too. Ikea type stuff, but I think good, better quality actually. Yeah, so this is the new digs, people. I quite like it. I'm really happy about it. And it's 7,000 baht a month. So that's about 300 bucks Australian a month. I'll put the details of that on the video when I um, when I upload it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. So this is the new digs. 7,000 baht a month, 700 a month for the internet. 700 is, uh, I'll work that out too. When I look at the exchange rates when I go home. So apparently, they never lock the front, they never shut the front door. They just lock this one with this uh, bolt here. and whack this padlock on. And uh, safe as chips, they leave this front door open to let the airflow in there, but I'm gonna close it. It can have some airflow when I come here. I'm just gonna test the key for this too, just to make sure I don't ever lock myself out. Yeah, that's the key for that. I'm not going to lock it because you've got the massive padlock on the back there. So, yes, that's it. In what's called Sports Village. I don't know that I'll padlock the gate. I don't think it's ever been padlocked. I've got another one of these here for it. So, we shall see. I'll just. Um, Put the uh, bottom bolt in. So that's it. That's where you're going to live, girl.
Ini. Dead end street, so fairly quiet. I think some foreigners live next door, next couple of houses. Yeah. Plenty of empty houses too, so yeah. I quite like it. Okay. Ciao for now. So, uh, I was in Hua Hin and I stopped at the night market on the way home after the dentist and after having something to eat. So, I thought, you know, while I'm here, I better shoot some video. So, here we go. Hua Hin night market every night. Very good. Good food. Aroi mai. <laughs> Sweets, canum, squid, barbecued squid, fresh cane, fresh sugar cane juice. Oh yeah. And over here, this is the most amazing stall I've ever seen in any market. Kittens galore, and look, he's got them all asleep. How well trained they are. You know, you can get uh, trinkets and things. Hooders. Hooders. Elephants. Uh, little wall hangings. You can get all your tricks here. Everything. Kids, kids outfits, cock and car. Roasted sweet potato, roasted bananas, roasted bananas on a stick, sweet corn, maize. Mm. But unfortunately, I've already eaten. I'll probably get some sweets here, some kanum on the way home, on the way out of here. Check this out. Check this out. Green lick mussels. Yes, more so 150 baht, mister. 150 yeah, baht for one portion uh, is almost 500 baht. Oh, that's 6 bucks for 400 grams. For 500 grams, almost. 400, 500? Yes. Almost 500 grams for 150 baht. Mm -mm. I show you. 6 bucks. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. no I show no, you. No. Which way? Like this. Yeah. Ah. So 6 bucks for those. For 150. 6 bucks for those. Um, Green lip mussels. Look at the size of those prawns. Yeah, very cool Check mussels. These out. Check these prawns out. Look. Check them out. Absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Lobster. Alani. Huh? Alani. Adan ku pideta. What do you call? <laughs> pideta. Pideta. Yeah. Look at that. It is the inspiration of Predator movie. Oh. Yeah, look at the mouth of them. Alien. Yeah, alien. Yeah, 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 yeah. More than one million years. Coconut crab. This is the horseshoe crab. Horseshoe crab. Only the egg inside. Ah. Uh. Barbecued rob lobster. Anyone? Toroi. Haroi. 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 One thousand baht. One thousand. One thousand baht, which is about uh, I don't know. I'll work see it out later. later. Next time, sir. See you later next time. Uh, up to you. You wanna see later or next time? Up to you. Oh yeah, later. Okay. Hope to see you. Cup and cup. Get your Hua Hin t-shirts. Hua Hin, Hua Hin, Hua Hin, Hua Hin. A 
the main road there and I'll be going home shortly. I've had enough of this. Oh, something I'd like to show you all that I know is just around the corner here. And here it is, look. 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 Fireworks. Fireworks openly on sale. You know, all sorts of fireworks. You know, you've got things that spin around. You've got these big suckers here. Look at the size of them. Skyrockets, look. That's a stall. Look, and there's a whole shop full in here. A whole shop full of fireworks. Look, absolutely wonderful. I'm gonna come in here and spend some money one day. You know, I think I'll wait for a Songkran. I mean, look at those skyrockets. Look at the size of these suckers here. Oh, there's lots of fun to be had in here. Look at all this stuff. I don't know what those are. Bombs of some kind. <laughs> Sam, Roy Bud, yeah? yeah? Okay. I get three for uh, five bucks. So, thanks very much for watching, as always. Well appreciated. And uh, please leave some comments. Uh, I really love to know what you see and if you enjoy it. Thanks very much for watching the channel. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, share the video, and uh, until next time, ciao for now. Thank you.